Hey guys, I'm Tom the Tech Chap, and I've been checking out MSI's new 2020 lineup of laptops, monitors, PCs, and basically just nerding out with all the cool tech. And at the end of the video, I want you to tell me in the comments below which you think is the most exciting or coolest new product. All right, so new at CES 2020, we have these two gaming laptops. We've got the uh, GS66 Stealth, which is their sort of thin and light, slightly smarter looking laptop. Uh, you could maybe take this into the office and you wouldn't get left out of a meeting. And for me, this is actually one of my favorite laptops. It's being updated with Intel's 10th gen H series chips, as well as Nvidia's next generation graphics cards. They won't tell me exactly what it is, probably the rumored super version of the RTX cards. So when this comes out in a few months, this will be a nice little upgrade in terms of performance. And you can see it's still relatively lightweight and also very thin for a gaming laptop. We also get now up to a 300 Hertz refresh rate screen. Now, two questions. Firstly, what games you've actually been able to play that get 300 FPS is another question. And also, can you tell between 240 and 300? But if you're a pro gamer and you want the fastest response screen possible, then you can spec this with 300 Hertz and it is crazy smooth. The Stealth also gets a new triple fan cooling design, which MSI say will provide up to 10% more airflow for better thermals. So that's the Stealth, but if you come over here with me, we then have the GE66 Raider, Ooh, breaking the uh, stand, which actually has identical specs to the Stealth, but it's a little bit thicker, a little bit heavier. We've also got this new RGB strip at the front, which you can customize. So it's got a bit more of a gamery vibe to it. So again, 10th gen processors, new RTX cards, and the 300 Hertz refresh rate screen. You also have this little bit at the back for the better cooling. So along with the extra thickness of it, you're going to be able to overclock this a bit further. You'll get slightly cooler temperatures than the uh, Stealth version of the laptop. Both the Stealth and the Raider also pack in massive 99.9 watt hour batteries, which is actually the biggest you can put in a laptop while still being able to take it on a plane with you. So we should see a nice boost in battery life as well. Now this has to be one of the coolest looking gaming laptops I've ever seen. It's actually a special edition of the new GE66 Raider and it's called the Dragon Shield. It's been designed by a chap called Colly Wurtz, who's a concept artist and worked on things like the Star Wars prequels, Iron Man, Transformers. And with these etched metal panels that resemble a spaceship, it definitely stands out. So while I do love to play games, unfortunately I don't have an awful lot of time these days, and so actually creator laptops like this, which give you the performance that you get normally with a gaming laptop, but in a slightly sleeker design with also a much more color accurate screen, this is the stuff that I actually get really excited about. And that's where the new Creator 17 Mini LED comes in. And as the name suggests, it's a 17 inch laptop, and actually it's using a whole new type of display using mini LEDs. So we get much better contrast ratios, deeper blacks, more vibrant colors, and and also higher brightness so we can get some properly good high dynamic range on this. Just look at that. And actually they've put it side by side with their previous version. Hopefully it doesn't fall off. <laughs> if, if I hold it, you can actually see a big difference when it comes to the deepness of the blacks and the richness of the colors. And of course that brightness, because when it comes to editing videos, particularly if you're editing, uh, you know, HDR content, then you're going to want a screen that can actually show it all off natively. But it's not just about the screen. This is also a bit of a performance power house. When this comes out, like MSI's other gaming laptops, this will have Intel's latest 10th generation H series processors. So these aren't going to come out for a few months, but we should see a nice boost in performance, probably 10 core uh, 20 thread chips, as well as RTX graphics. If you're a creator like me and you're editing 4K videos or raw photos, then this is definitely one to look out for. From crazy looking laptops to desktops. I mean, just look at this thing. It's the new MSI Meg Aegis TI5 gaming desktop. And as you'd expect, it's an absolute powerhouse with up to an RTX 2080 Ti, 10th gen Intel Core i9 processors. But without a doubt, it's the design, along with this quite unique looking button knob thing, which they're calling the HMI, which stands for Human Machine Interface. And also the fact it's the first 5G compatible desktop that's actually coming to market. So the HMI wheel button thing on the front can customize the lighting, switch to different game modes, and also give you system information like CPU speeds and temperatures. I'm not sure how often I'd actually use it, but I do like the idea of it and it certainly looks cool. Now next to it, we have the new MSI Optics Meg 38.1 CQR. Not the catchiest of names, but this 38 inch ultra wide gaming monitor, which also has its own integrated HMI. There's a little OLED screen in the bottom corner. It's a great gaming monitor with a 144 Hz refresh and 3840 by 1600 resolution. Sticking with monitors, and this is what MSI are saying is the world's first gaming monitor with a 1000R curve. So you get that cool wraparound experience. 
And with a 1 millisecond response time, 144Hz refresh, this 32 inch ultra wide is one to look out for. So that's all well and good, but if you need something for on the go when you're traveling, then the Optix Mag 161 is an external monitor for your laptop. Plug it in via HDMI or USB-C, and you get a 15.6 inch IPS screen that supports up to a battery 240 hertz refresh. So again, this is ideal for gaming. So much tech, so little time, but MSI are also showing off a range of motherboards, PC cases, graphics cards, and also some pretty smart looking peripherals, including this, the CK40 keyboard, the CM30 mouse, and even these CH40 wireless earbuds, and they all come in their prestige white color scheme. It's great to see MSI embracing the more creative and professional audiences with these. Okay, so what do you think? Which of these are you most excited for? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And if you want to see more from me, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below. And I'll catch you next time right here on the Tech Chat.